got a review for you. Check it out. This right here, the brand new Q800 Pro. You best to believe I'm gonna be bringing you some nice footage off of this camera for show. Okay, we're gonna get that thing mounted up in this 2018 C63 AMG C63S. Get it right. Let me get it right. All right. Along with this box, which is our the brand new camera from their product line, it's a um, let's see, it has 1440 QHD Sony Exmor R Starvis chip chipset. Um, we're looking for superior recording with this camera, so we're gonna be unboxing that. Along with the camera, I also ordered some filters, some um. You know they, you know they go in there to keep the the light out, the glare that you would normally see when you're driving your vehicle, when you're looking back at your your camera footage. It's supposed to get rid of all of that glare, so I went ahead and I got that. Can you believe I purchased this back in May? I'm just now unboxing it. I mean, like, who finds herself to be that occupied with things that they can't get a piece of technology like this in their car after purchasing it? I don't understand. Me, of course. But on the other hand, let's go ahead and get into the unboxing of this right now, okay? First thing we have is our camera here. And as you can see already, if you're familiar with the Thinkware product line, is that this baby is super slim. The previous camera that I did have, was to, which was the Thinkware F750, so much more bigger than this camera here. I mean, if you just take a look at that, that is super sleek. You're not going to be seeing that at all. Two-channel, QHD, full high-definition digital recorder. GPS, Wi-Fi capable. So you're going to be getting your updates and everything via Wi-Fi, opposed to having to go through the app and everything. Just get your Wi-Fi connection set up and when you're within the vicinity you'll be able to get those updates and things you know the necessary updates required for your camera put that there let's see what else is in the box alright next we got our owner's manual Thinkware Q800 quick start warranty and guide in warranty not too much of a quick start here, looks like. I mean, look at the thickness of that. But then again, it is in multiple languages. And English, the only... Not too big for English, I would say. This is everything for English right there. So, it's just a whole bunch of different languages. So, calm down. Because I was about to freak out, okay? So, I'm going to put that there. Also, you get your connection and service tutorial. Connect your smartphone to the dash cam via Wi-Fi hotspot or cloud to view recorded footage and manage that dash cam settings. Um, gives you a, a QR code to scan for a tutorial and yeah, not too bad. Customer service information. Oh, so many, so many goodies in the box. It's crazy. So this box over here. All right, so it comes with two. Well, it comes with the memory card, and it comes with the adapter. Um, the memory card is only 32 gigabytes. Nothing. Nothing. You're gonna need a lot more than the 32 megabytes. Okay. So I want to make be sure I purchase a 128 high speed card from Best Buy, but this is enough to get you started. Okay. So you got your memory card here. You sit that there. You have your piece of mount here, which you mount to your vehicle, and your camera locks into place and just locks into place on here, which allows for quick removal, installation, and what so. So just like so, you put that there, slide it over, and it's locked into place. So voila. Next thing we have is a, it comes with a USB stick. Cool. All right, so this USB stick has a slot for your SD card, which allows you to quickly transfer the files over. So 
that is awesome. I already have a USB stick, but this one is a lot smaller, and I like this. It's going to make far more convenient. It's going to make it a lot easier for me to transfer my footage, so I'm glad they provided this for us. Next thing we have here is we have some wire clips with some adhesive backings to it, which is going to allow you to get that clean installation. It appears to only have three of them in there, but if you space them properly, it should make do for some fine wiring. Hmm. All right, so you have another adhesive back here, which is for the back of this in case you have to remove it. It comes with a spare, so bravo for that because the previous version didn't come with that, okay? All right, so it also comes with a wire for a cigarette lighter installation, but I have a hardwired cable kit, so we're going to be doing a hardwired installation to C63 because me don't want no wires showing. We're going to be covering all those wires up, okay? So, but that goes for the unboxing of this Thinkware Q800 Pro dash cam. Um, I mean, if you look at the video online on their website, you will see exactly why I opted for this. You know, the first thing I did is I went to BestBuy.com, looking for the latest and greatest and Keep in mind, if you want the latest and greatest of anything, go to the manufacturer's website first because they're not going to push a lot of their products out to retail stores until they sell out of everything that they pre of the previous models, which is what Best Buy currently have is their previous model. So, you know, I bought it and then I returned it and I went on their site and I found this thing and we're going to see what it do. So let's unbox these filters and see what they look like also. Shouldn't be much of nothing at all. Okay, so as you can see, it's very small. Um, we have two filters in here. It looks like two. Let's see, it's a CPL filter. Romantic. Let's see, all dash cams experience dashboard glares in times of extreme light. With the help of circular polarizing filter, Dashboard reflections and glares can be exponentially reduced from video footage, which instantly increasing the color saturation and contrast. All right, so. All right, so this is our instructions. On the CPL, you will find two guide points. The two guide points Align vertically with the camera lens, position the filter with one of the guide points placed either at the top or bottom. Once you're satisfied with the position, peel to protect the film off the sticky pad and place the filter onto the camera lens with the guide points vertically aligned. Okay? So, it appears that there is two in here unless it's just that thick. Because I purchased two of these things. So, I'm going to open one just to, be, just to be sure that there is only one in the box. So, I, I make sure I'll check that out after I do the install because it appears I have two of them with this kit. So, but we're going to find out though, okay? But all else aside, guys, it was a pretty simple review. Um, I'm going to end it right there. Hope you enjoyed the video. Um, be sure to go check out thinkwear-cams.com. Why you should get those, these guys over black box? I would say because you don't have to buy external, not black box, but over the, ooh, what's there? That bird, that, um, the name of that other one. They make the 4K in dash camera kit. But anyway, the only reason I didn't go with those guys, which I'm sure you guys know who I'm talking about. I can't think of the name at the moment. They made a 4K camera and it's a big, big brand. But I didn't go with them because from what I understand is you have to have an external hard drive in order to record media opposed to this having the in-camera storage micro USB card. So yeah, that's why. And because I like think where the maneuverability of the application camera so easy already had their previous camera i was happy with it so yeah we're gonna go with these guys and i hope you guys find interest and find something you like and 
Just make sure you get something in the vehicle. There's so many crazy things going on out there. You don't want to miss a thing, I'm telling you. Many instances between the time of now and when I purchased this camera that I wish I would have had the camera in the car. So, luckily, no, then nothing has happened to the vehicle. So, Woo. keep my fingers crossed on that. But, hey, in the meantime, it's your boy C-Spec Kurt. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please like, share, subscribe. Mm. And we're going to get on with this thing. Stay on the lookout for the install video. Peace.